Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I am currently on my way to work. Um, so I think I'm running a little bit behind schedule as I, you know, I normally, normally should have left like 10 minutes ago. But anyway, y'all, I wanted to get on here and do a quick video just talking about Liv's life. Um, I don't, I rarely even um, react to her, but I just have a little something to say. Just my thoughts, y'all. Just my thoughts. Okay, um, Liv, you know, recently just showed the world that she has a new fling going on, right? Okay, and then she says that she has been knowing him for quite some time. Okay, now if y'all wanted to go back and, and, and look at her history about her flings that she had, okay, we're gonna do that. Now... To me, y'all, I think Liv is broke because uh, her heart her heart is broken. She's a broken woman because her heart is broken because the man that she's known for years don't want her. And, you know, we've all been through that situation before. You know, maybe some, maybe, you know, maybe uh, not or whatever. But we've all been there to where we, we wanted this particular guy. Um, and we tried our best to try to think we were making it work. And it doesn't work out. So that's what she did. You know, from Texas, when he when Gerard decided that he, he wasn't going to, um, he didn't want to be with her anymore. You know, he ups and he moves to Texas, his home where his family is from because you know he had originally moved to uh to florida to be with you know his wife right they get married and everything everything is sweet so we thought so he's there things don't work out he moves back to texas you know lives live is like you know what i, I want to be around my my kid's dad you know, I want this to work for not only myself, but I want him to be there for his children. Which, y'all, I can understand that. I, I get that, right? So, she she ups and she moves from Florida to Texas. She gets to Texas and then, you know, she tries. She, she's knowing that Ger Gerard is messing around with somebody else. But she's thinking in her head that I can get him back. I already know, no matter who he with, if I whip this thing on him, he's going to come back. He's he going to come back. So she goes to Texas, moves there, do what she, you know, she had to do to try to get her husband back. Because, yes, they're, they're still married. Um, and she's seen it doesn't work. She's doing everything to just to uh, say nasty things about him and the new girl that he's with. Um, but she's, she's still noticing that whatever he says or whatever she says, he's not budging. He's still going to rock with the new girl. So Brandon comes along, you know, and then she states that she's been knowing Brandon for quite some time, right? Okay. So Brandon comes along. She's kicking it with Brandon. Brandon is on um, camera finally. We talk to Brandon, you know. A lot of stuff come out that she was saying that she was still sleeping with Gerard or whatever. Um, you know, still trying to get her husband back. She just doesn't realize that Gerard is tired. Now, y'all know the thing. Um. When you tire, you tire. You don't, you know that you've moved on from somebody uh, when you can look at them and feel nothing. Um, you, you, and that's, 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 that's how it appears to be when it comes to Gerard, right? He can look and live and feel nothing for her anymore. But, you know, for whatever reason, live still can't past that she's feeling that no I got this man this man loves me we have kids together okay 
Well, when Liz, you know, figured out that that didn't work, she said, you know what, I'm going back home. You know, where my mom is there, my sister is there, my family is there. I have no family here. Yes, his kids, his kids, uh, my kids, our kids' dad lives in Texas. He doesn't want to be with me. It's not that he don't want to be with his kids. He doesn't want to be with her. You know, she's thinking that, oh, to be with, to, 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 to help take care of our children, you have to be with me. And that's not how it goes. So... She says, okay, I'm about to go ahead and get up, and I'm going to move back to where I know that I'm loved. She moves back to Florida, you know. She, you know, I, I kind of almost thought that Brandon was going to ride with her and, and stay with her in Florida because he, he helped her move down there, um, you know, and he was, he was there for a second or whatever. Had us all thinking, you know, this is, this is, he was going to be the one. Well, he didn't turn out to be the one, as y'all all know. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. So he moves her down there. They, they, they didn't have a falling out. He was at the point to where he was uh, going to expose her. She was, you know, exposing him or just dogging him or whatever. And then that chatter stopped. You know, she didn't want to talk about him anymore. She didn't want him to be a part of her life. You know, she, you know, it's claimed that she's moved on. Now, if you do the timelines between these guys, because y'all, honestly, I have never really seen live with anybody else but these, these guys, right? So I have no idea on who, everybody else you know I've, I've heard that she has talked to different men but honestly I have not seen her talk to anybody well I haven't seen her I haven't seen the visual part now she's probably talked to a lot of different guys um in in the midst of this um this breakup with her husband but I've only guy that I've seen is Gerard Brandon and then um now the new guy um, but if y'all, if y'all, if y'all know that, that it was another guy on the scene, just leave it in my comments down below. Um, but now it's, it's the new guy, you know, all these guys got to be boo bay, whatever. And see where the brokenness comes in at live is, um, she doesn't, she doesn't, she doesn't know how to be by herself. Um, yeah, it sucks to be a single parent, but technically are you a single parent because you're not with the father anymore? Or are you a single parent because the dad no longer wants to help you? Because that's how, you know, most of us have felt when the dad is not there in our kids' lives. That's what makes us a single parent, right? Let me know in the comments down below if that's how y'all feel or not. What y'all definition of a single parent is. So, because Liv always says she's a single mom of XYZ. So... Let me know what y'all think. You know, if y'all think the same way, um, just let me know. But now, her, you know, her brokenness comes in because she's moved from a husband, you know, to Brandon. Brandon hasn't been gone for three months. You know, he hasn't been, you know, out of her life for three months. Now the new guy has come in because she hasn't been living in her place for three months, right? The new guy. And what she say, y'all, she says that, oh, I've been knowing him. He's no one new. He, uh, I've, I've seen the, the, the talks about, you know, he's a bad, bad guy. He has, I've seen the tattoos. He has a lot of tattoos. I do not like guys with tattoos on their face. You know, I mean, there have been some handsome men that, but they, you know, why I put a tattoo on your face, but to each his own. Um, and they said that he's a bad guy. He does this, he does that. Only thing, y'all, um, you can tell, uh, you know, a female that he, uh, that they're, um, they're making a big mistake. But my only mistake comes into play because you can't, you don't 
know a guy, he looked like he could be, because he got tattoos everywhere, but he may be the one that may be the sweetest guy ever. You know what I mean? It's because he got tattoos everywhere. He could be so sweet and nice and caring. And um, he may be different. Just because he got tattoos everywhere don't mean that he's a killer. He just like tattoos, right? But uh, still, I think that she needs to heal. She needed to heal. Regardless if she would have found this guy six months down the line or not, I'm not telling her, you know, that she shouldn't be with um, anybody. Do do what you feel. But to me, she's just covering up because she's heartbroken. You know, she's got, she had a husband, didn't work out. She got with Brandon, turned out he wasn't it. So now that, she, you know, she, she wants to fill the void that her heart, is missing she's broken she hasn't given herself no time whatsoever to heal so she's gonna hop from man to man to man she's gonna give up all the, the goods until she realizes that she is worth more than what she's putting out there yeah i don't i don't know i don't know tell me what y'all think in my comments um, I'm not here to bash her at all. I'm just, she's broken, you know, facts. Cause we've all been there. We've all been broken to the fact that we're going to find love some way, somehow, you know, we're, we're going to feel what we've been missing some way, somehow. So if I got to go from this guy to this guy, to this guy to find love, I'm going to do that. But not knowing that, you know, She's her, she's giving her her soul, you know, her soul ties is just it's it's not um it's not that's not a good look for her. It's not because it's too many different men. Um and it's uh yeah. You know, and do, and you know one thing that I that I have heard it is you know, nowadays you can't trust a lot of guys. You do need to go. Like, can we go to the clinic real quick? I just need to make sure that you good. <laughs> so you have you be sitting there. You be thinking like, let me go ahead and you know make sure that we straight because you a lot of men, a lot of women don't tell you the truth about you know their lives. But y'all, I am at work. I'm about to go into the garage. Hold on. Um, about to go into the garage and get to work. But y'all just tell me what y'all think in the comments down below. Y'all, uh, my next video will be of um, my daughter and her prom. Mm. That'll be out later on today. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to premiere. If I'm able to premiere it, I will definitely premiere it. So I can be in the comment section with you all. First time. I don't know. If, since I'm not monetized, I don't know if I'm able to do that or not. But it's worth a, it's worth a shot. Um, even, even if I can't, the video's going up. You guys leave a comment. Let me know um, what y'all thought about her prom. But y'all, let me go home, get off of here, get parked, and, and, and go do some work. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead, y'all. Go ahead and um, subscribe to my channel. And if you like what I just discussed, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. And until next time, y'all, be later on today. Bye.